what I've got here is what I call the Super Smasher. I'm going to use this attachment on my on my press to smash these cans and condense them down to a smaller piece so that I can melt them into ingots a lot faster and much more efficient. As I was smashing cans, I found found an old can. It's pretty old. I'm not sure what uh, year this came out, but uh, let's see. Right here it has a trademark, the 1980 Olympic Committee. So it's got to be. Maybe that old, at least. So this right here is an entire large black trash bag worth of cans. Each one of these cylinders is about 80 cans. All right, here's the crucible, and here's our pieces of cans, and they they fit in there, fit in there pretty good. So, here we go. We can put almost all of these cans in there. Almost 133 cans in one crucible at a time. There's a little bit left. Okay, so I've got all my cans smashed. Then we're gonna weigh these and see what we got. Here's my scale. Okay, so that's our first tub, 51 and a half pounds. This is the lighter of the two. Do one and a half. This is the second one. We've got 71.3, we'll just call it 71 pounds. Basically 123 pounds worth of cans. And these, I'll just say, let's see. Okay, so a tub, one of these tubs weighs approximately five and a half pounds. Okay, so total, 
we've got 112 pounds of cans. Each can roughly weighs 14.9 grams. So we take uh, pounds, convert to grams, which is 50,802.3 grams. We divide that by our 14.9 grams per can, and that gives us 3,409 cans, roughly. So, so I'm pretty stoked. Thanks for watching. Um, next video, I'm going to melt all these down into some shiny, pretty ingots. And uh, we'll see how long it takes. So come back and see me so you can check that one out.